marked opening 67, a few different colours on the card, but all in all it was a great opening round, wasn't it? Yeah, yeah, very pleased. Um, only played nine holes in practice, so first night today, um, I hadn't seen it yet, so it was nice to hit a lot of fairways and um, didn't get in too much trouble apart from the one hole that you said. Um, kind of poor bunker shot there and ended up double bogey, but um, delighted with that start today. Usually when we come to these resort courses, we expect the wide fairways, the forgiving rough. Not the case this week. How's the uh, course suit your eye? Yeah, it's, it's demanding off the tee. Um, roughs as unpredictable and difficult as I've seen all year, to be honest. Um, you know, your fairways are an absolute premium, an absolute must. Um, and I'd say that was probably what I did really well today, was hit the fairways and managed to set up some good opportunities after that. But you can come unstuck pretty easily if you kind of take your eye off the ball or you start hitting it rough. And But yeah, like you said, resort course, you expect it. You know, I was expecting to come here and just be low scoring and everything else, but it's a proper test. It feels like uh, things are trending in the right direction, especially during this Spanish swing of yours. I mean, what is it that's changing and, and that you love so much at the moment in your swing? Yeah, I think I started working with Matt Belsham about three months ago now, uh, maybe three and a half months ago or so, and started off with a good result in Sweden, finished second there pretty much second week. Um, and slowly but surely been getting better and better but results hadn't really been getting there and you're kind of watching Race to Dubai and you're dropping down week by week and um, you know Harry McCaddy saying stay patient, Matt was saying stay patient, results will come but when you're kind of you're missing cuts it's tough to stay patient and um, you know obviously a good week in Madrid a couple of weeks ago um, I finished eighth there last year as well so I was kind of trying to relive a lot of that in my head before, the, before that week and then um, a bit uncanny to finish eighth again, but it was nice to to see a bit of a jump in the right direction up the race of the bye and just carrying that form on. Really, um, there was a lot of good stuff last week. The poor finish on Sunday, which was disappointing, but good to get back back with a good start again today. Well, best luck this week. Thanks. Cheers. For your time. Thank you very much. Thanks, Mark.